Hello everyone, my name is Sutton the Wolf, and welcome back to Purino Party. We just got done with Miyako's first episode, and I, I liked her. She was really cute, and she didn't seem, like, as pervy as um, Yogiri or um, Suzu. So, I, I like her. She she's cute. So, her and Sora are definitely my favorites. But, uh, not to say that I dislike Yogiri or uh, Suzu. They're, they're cool. Um... I do like how Yogiri is all mysterious, and Suzu's really easygoing, but like, I don't know, maybe I just like the, maybe I really like the cute ones over the sexy ones. But, alright, so I have to randomly select one again, um, and I've decided that I'm going to, uh, alternate again. So I'm going to play through all of their episode 2s, so I don't just like burn myself out on one character and then never see them again. So, I'm gonna pick randomly. So, oh, sorry again. Okay. Oh, what cute outfit. Okay, so it's a little harder this time. All right. Um. So you liked you? What did you like? Music. Okay, you like music. Uh. Wow. A lot of pink ones. Um. All right. Ha. Uh, and ha. 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 Not bad. Um, alright, I need to get some fever going. Alright. Ah. Uh, ha. 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 Alright. How about that? Well, fever at least. Uh, I need to get going here. Um, let's keep the fever up. Get that fever going. Alright, I'm gonna set up for a big one. Yeah! Fuck yeah! How about that? Boom! I am already getting a handle on this game. Alright. Hell yeah. And no, before you ask, I have not practiced this at all. That was just straight up first attempt. Nice. Alright. Where's Sora? There she is. Oi, Sora-chan! Oh yeah, I'm her big brother. That's right. I was looking for you. I mean, sure, if you want to play a video game. Oh, no, I just wanted to talk to you. <laughs> but games! Onichan! <laughs> nice. Sorry, I left my console in my room. I could easily go get it, but, you know. <laughs> then go get it so I can play. I like her. I like her. She's got a decent head on her shoulders. <laughs> Wow, she definitely has, like, she kind of has that mentality that I used to have. Like, nowadays, I'm completely laid back, and I'm just like, you know what? Who cares if I sleep in until 2 o'clock today? I don't have class the rest of the day. But, uh, I used to be like, okay, I'm gonna take 5 to 10 minute showers, I'm gonna get 5 hours of sleep, I'm gonna get up at 7 o'clock in the morning every single morning so I can make the most out of every single day, so I can do whatever I want, so I can get my stuff done, so I can have as much time to hang out as I can. Like, that definitely was me. So I could totally see that. I can totally see that mentality. Ah! What? Alas! I forgot I had something to do. Oh, okay. What do you have? Woo! I love that sound effect. Why is she in such a hurry? The question. Okay, don't don't mind me. I'm just barging in. Is that a totem pole? And that's a Mua That's a... Mua'i... Maui? Mua'i. Moai? Maui? Maui? Polynesian Stonehead. I think those are from Polynesia, yeah? But that's a, this is a decent enough looking room. Halloween stuff. Soda-chan! Toshitano! Rudy Princess. Oh, is this gonna be like a, one of those... Is that- okay, this is gonna be one of her shows where she gets all into, like, making out with her brother and stuff. 
Fruity Princess? Anime! Mikan! Oh! Oh, well, I guess I was wrong. That's nice. Oh! See, I can relate- I, again, I can relate to that, because, like, I've watched animes before where the mute- the soundtrack is really good, and so I'd actually, like, look them up on YouTube and favorite them, and listen to them every once in a while, so I totally get that. Hmm, it's that good? You know what? Sure. I'm- I ain't got nothing else to do. Let's watch some anime. And it- oh, is it for little- oh, it's one of those? Okay. I was talking more so, like, Ones where, like, they just happen to have, like, really good songs that play. I guess she's talking about where, like... Oh, yeah, she said it was, like, a pop star. Okay, so I guess this is one of those, like, little kid ones where it's, like... You have the rising pop star character who, like, sings her heart out on stage and whatnot. Okay. I mean... Yeah, I mean, that's a pretty simple decision. Sure, I'd love to check it out. If you're so into it, it's gotta be good. Yeah, I mean... Try, any, try anything once, right? That face. But yeah, like, I mean, try anything once, right? Like, that's my mentality when it comes to a lot of things, like food, TV shows, movies, a lot of those things. I know I don't watch movies very often, but like, when it comes down to it, I'm never going to say that I don't want to watch a movie just because I don't want to, or like, because I think it's going to be terrible. That's the big one. Like, if I think a movie's going to be terrible, like, I, I prefer to have the mentality of like, oh, hey, prove me wrong, please. Like, they wouldn't produce these movies if there's not someone who likes it, so why not? I mean, if it's good enough to be enjoyed by somebody, it's gotta be good enough to be enjoyed by someone else, right? Okay. Oh, soda smells kinda nice. She's really cute. I, I like the little fang that they gave her. That's funny. Aw, oh, darn, we don't actually get to watch it. Darn, they didn't think too far into it. Oh well. Musical note. I gotta say, it was really interesting. It had some great jokes, but some scenes were really exciting too. I even teared up a little at one point. Oh wow, that good? Wow, that is so mo. I just realized like how ginormous her eye was. Oh my goodness, that is so mo. Mo, by the way, is like an anime term. Um, I, I don't know it well enough to confirm it. All I know about it is that the characters are, like, really... The art style, a lot of the time, is really cutesy and has the ginormous eyes and whatnot. But, uh, that, that's all I really know about it. But you can go ahead and look that up, because I'm not qualified to talk about it. Man, that opening theme, that was a good one. I'll tell you that much. Seem to be really connecting here. <laughs> oh, am I going to get a dance show? Is that how this is going? Yes, going there. Now that I think about it, have you ever considered becoming a pop star, Soda? Huh? Eh? That'd be kind of cool. Don't all girls want to be pop stars? Or is that just a stereotype? <clears throat> stereotype. But, I mean, sure. <laughs> uh, <laughs> wow. Nice. Well, I didn't see it, so I cannot tell you, Soda-chan. Hmm? I thought it was really cute. Oh, is she gonna want to wear it now? Is that how this is going? <laughs> you have it? Oh my goodness. Okay. Eh? Really? Majide. <laughs> nice. Wow. Fair enough. Well, I mean, I guess, I guess I have the ears, so I have the ears and tail, so I guess I can't judge. Childish girl like you, so I haven't tried it on. Yeah, I guess you are kind of childish, but I mean, I mean, I mean, wear whatever you want, like, honestly. I think it would look great. These, these decisions seem to be relatively easy. I'll, I'll be honest there, it's not really difficult. I think it would look great on you. Well, well, you should try it on at least once. 
that that I'll agree with. Like, if you have doubts about something, if you think that like it's gonna be embarrassing or something, I'll admit the first time I ever like the first I I'll I'll confess here like I I lost a bet originally and that's what made me like buy the ears and tail. Um, I lost a Halloween bet actually to a good friend of mine from my hometown, and uh, the whole bet was um, ahead of time we like decide what the Halloween costume is going to be, and then whoever loses has to wear it for a, spe a specific amount of time. I remember one time it was like, a, um, I remember one time there was like this really funny maid outfit that we were going to do. We ended up not doing it because it was really like kind of sketchy. Plus, none of neither of us wanted to have to go through that with that. But uh, this was one of those outfits, and it was like, okay, well, you're going to have to... I lost, so it's like, okay, well, you have to be a furry for a month. And it's like, okay, well, I'm going to dress up like a furry for a month. And I, I'll admit, in the very beginning, it was so embarrassing. Like, I was walking around campus, everyone looked at me weird. But, like, surprisingly enough, like, nobody really questioned it. And so, it was actually kind of heartwarming, because it was like... All of, rather than people walking up to me and making fun of me, it turned into like a, oh hey, that's a conversation starter. And then like everyone started to recognize me and they'd talk to me about it. And it like, I actually made some good friends because of the ears and tail. So like, I have to thank my friend for forcing me through that bet. It ended up out really nice. And of course I won't like, I don't wear it out in public anymore, but like, it's, it's nice. And so, I mean, that's why I wear it during my videos, because it's it was kind of that heartwarming feeling. But, uh, no, I won't say that, like, I don't wear it out in public. I'm not really into that sort of thing, but, like, it was pleasantly surprising, I'll say. It was pleasantly surprising. Wow, I just completely went off on a tangent there. Sutton the Wolf lore! <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, hey, say hi to the camera, Nick. Hi. Here, get a little closer here. People, let the people of the world see you. This is my roommate, Nick, guys. So, uh, he might join me for some episodes later on. I don't know if it'll be for this, but, uh, yeah, look forward to it. <laughs> I can't believe you're doing that. Okay, hold on. Before you jump to assumptions, Okay. I was bought this game by a friend. Uh -huh. And I didn't know what it was. Oh, okay. I didn't know what it was. Okay. I was told it had to do with anime and mm -hmm. puzzles. Mm -hmm. And so I was like, okay, fine, I'll give it a try. But like, I'll be honest, it's pleasant. I mean, it's, I'll admit, it's like way too pervy at times. But like, <laughs> there, there are certain parts that are really nice. Like, th this, this episode is actually pretty nice. Yeah. <laughs> <It's> fun. <laughs> Shut up, that's, you. That's fun. Shut the fuck up. You know, you know, I'm not into that. God damn it. All right. Make sure the door is locked, will you? Hello. Jeez. All right. Well, back on track. God damn it. I can't take that seriously anymore. God damn it. Thanks a lot, Nick. All right. I'll try on my pop star costume and show you when I get the chance. All right. Okay, sounds great. Wow, we just went on a completely huge tangent there. New image. What is this? Oh, okay, now it's starting to get pervy. That's right. All right. I'm going to have to censor that. I see you looking over there. <laughs> Pervert. <laughs> Yep, I'm, I'm definitely going to have to put a bit on that. Well, test my editing skills, I guess. Alright, well, sorry about that large tangent, guys. But uh, a little bit more about me for you. But uh, anyways, leave a like, comment, and subscribe below. All that stuff really does help me out as a YouTuber. And I'll see you guys next time on Purino Party.